Hey guys, and we are back with some more Sonic Generations action. Let's move my mouse cursor off the screen. Anyway, um, where was we last time? Okay, we did um, Sea Hill Side Hill Side thing. What's it called? Seaside Hill. Okay, so we need to get the free keys now in order to get to the next boss, and then we can move on boosh, through here. So let's check out the challenges. Um, the challenges are usually up on top here. This is a let me up. Over here. Um, nothing here. Okay. Okay, we suck. <laughs> let's keep going back this way. Let me up, let me up. Yeah, so we need to do three challenges in order to get three more keys to progress further on in the game and unlock some more epic sort of uh, levels of excitement and hair raising and okay there's nothing here we have appeared to go back to where we was okay so we need to continue going left um, maybe we need to get some of the red coins in the missions too in order to unlock some challenges because there's like a sea over there there is nothing over that side and uh, there appears to be nothing here too. Yeah, I think we need to unlock some characters. So I think we need to go back into old school Sonic and redo some of these missions. Unfortunately, <laughs> it's kind of mixed uh, the playthrough. Go a little, a little bit longer because there's going to be some more episodes. But anyway, let's just continue onwards. So we're going to do Speed Highway with old fashioned Sonic. Okay, so... I didn't know Speed Highway was available for Old Fashioned Sonic, but we're obviously about to find out now that it maybe was. I don't know. I can't imagine Speed Highway being available for the Old Fashioned Sonic games. I can't remember it being available on there, but maybe they just made it available on here. Okay. Wow, this is kind of fast for a side scroll. Hopefully we can do this in ease as well. Um, I turned the recording quality down a little bit too because um, I think it was affecting my frame rate actually. Let's continue onwards. Yeah, I think it was affecting my frame rate in my last recording. So I decided to turn it down to 720 rather than recording in a 1080, which I did sort of compress down into uh, 720 anyway with uh, my recording software, which kind of makes no sense. But anyway, that's what I did. And then we just hurt ourselves again. And oh wow, wow, can I control this? Nope. Out the way, out the way, out the way, out the way. The only concern I got from playing uh, modern day Sonic and then going back to like old fashioned Sonic is that the controls are different. So you kind of you kind of lose the, the momentum in it, so you kind of sort of like uh, you sort of derp out a little bit during gameplay because you kind of still think you're playing modern day Sonic when you're not, if that makes any sense to you guys at all. Because <laughs> the controls are quite different. Oh, that was close. That was so close. Whoa! Okay, okay, we're good. Checkpoint reached. Ring the bell. Oh yeah, rings. Who would have thought rings come out of bells? And now I just derped up. Hmm. I'm actually using my um, N64 keyboard as well on here. Um, the, my Microsoft one, which is connected to my PC. If you're interested in knowing that type of stuff. Oh, oh no. Where am I to? Okay, we're back down here. This is proven to be quite tricky too. Okay, we're out, we're out, finally. And then back, and then up. Helicopter time! Oh yes! I wonder if we're going to do the, the part where we run down the side of a building or not. I wonder. Anyway, let's continue onwards! No, I failed! <laughs> Oh man, not again. I'm going to be getting myself a new microphone too as well guys. Um, I think I've had it with this. I'm going to continue using my um, Turtle Beaches as a headset, but for microphone and recording, I think I'm going to go with something else. And I missed 
do that. Yeah, I'm not going to go with like a, a roadcast podcast microphone because that gives you a radio voice. And which puts a lot of bass into your voice. I'm going to go with something... I'm definitely going to go with a condenser microphone, though um, there's no point really considering that I'm recording in my home. And uh, I don't need something that is multi-directional, so a condenser microphone is not always the best way to go. I could go with something dynamic or something that is om not omnidirectional, but something that has got beaming in it, so it pretty much records your voice only, so you don't have to listen to like mouses clicking and stuff like that. But uh, I'm going to use my knowledge from being in college and studying sound engineering, and I'm going to get a condenser microphone that is omnidirectional and something that um, you can adjust quite easily. Anyway, we did that quite uh, quite smoothly. Yeah, so I'm going to get something that's quite omnidirectional, so I can um, I can cater it to whatever I'm recording. Maybe like Minecraft. Some like I do like the sound of like uh, the keyboard being clicked and so forth like that. Anyway, I wonder if we've unlocked this character. I think it's like the the rabbit or the bunny character. Oh yes. She's got a little KO too, but I think some people call them chows. Thanks, Sonic. Thanks, Tony. Or did you get a new haircut? He's put on ten pounds of fat. He's fat. Mr. Sonic. Oh, don't forget. Oh, don't get me wrong. You're here. I mean, spikes. Look fine. Like that, too. Oh. Okay, we got some new artwork. Okay, I think that's going to be it for today, guys. Make sure you tune in tomorrow for some more Sonic Generations. We're going to try and get the game over and done with as soon as possible. Obviously not 100% finished, but uh, make sure you come back tomorrow and we will do City Escape. So thanks for watching, guys, and peace out.